Li-Fi Internet proving its worth. A company wants to digitize your consciousness, a new record set with entangled electrons, and a new chip that will charge a battery in less than 10 minutes. These are today's bits. Not long ago, the concept of Li-Fi came out as a possible alternative to Wi-Fi. The idea was to use light rather than radio signal to transmit and receive data. Of course, this concept yielded much higher data transfer speeds than Wi-Fi did, but was somewhat questioned by the dependency of line of sight to work. While the line of sight thing is still true, scientists have now put the technology to a real world test by installing it in an office and industrial environment. During the test, they were able to maintain data transmission speeds of one gigabit per second, much faster than the average Wi-Fi signal we use today. Check out the links in the description to read more on how they envision getting internet from every light bulb in the house. This is in very early development right now and still has some hurdles to jump over, but I can see a day where Wi-Fi and Li-Fi work together to get you internet access while you're out of line of sight while boosting your speed when Li-Fi is available. Transferring your consciousness into a computer or a robot. Okay, so this isn't exactly a thing, but it's still an interesting idea. The new startup company called Humai, Humea says that they are planning to have this ability within the next 30 years. Sorry, I probably destroyed that name. They're looking to more or less cryogenically freeze a person's brain and then transferring it into an artificial body once the technology becomes available. I'll link to the article in the description, but to sum it up, many people think that it's not gonna be possible and the company in question is heavily dependent on technology that hasn't even been invented yet. I think this could be a huge step for humanity in kind of a weird way, but also think that it's way too early to consider it a possibility. Possibility. Speaking of possibility, let's talk about the possibilities of entangling two electrons. In concept, two electrons can be entangled together, where if one electron was made to rotate in one direction, the other one would mimic that action. You might be asking yourself, why would this matter? Well, imagine a cluster of electrons entangled together with a completely separate cluster. Now, no matter how far these two clusters are apart, each one would mimic the actions of their counterpart. Now imagine, since then in theory, the distance between the electrons have no limit, you had a 10 gigabit internet connection with less than one millisecond delay between Mars and Earth. Of course, this idea of transferring information via entanglement is still in debate as far as how useful it'll be, but if the technology were developed enough, many applications could come from it, and researchers from Stanford have just set a new record in entanglement distance of 1.2 miles. Not much else could be said about this story because it's just them jumping over another hurdle. However, the idea of having instant communication over any distance that cannot be hacked is still intriguing. A new chip developed by Professor Rashid Yazami from Singapore brings promise of charging your cell phone in less than 10 minutes. Even better, the chip itself is said to be scalable to larger batteries like those used in electric vehicles. The invention itself took five years to develop. It claims to do its magic by monitoring the battery's health and ability to take higher charges and then regulating how much power gets pushed to it. And since the battery's ability to take higher charges depends solely on the overall health of the battery, that would mean that older batteries would be charging a little bit slower. Right now, the chip is expected to be ready for manufacturers by the end of 2016. Tesla, Sony, Sanyo, and Samsung have already com Samsung, 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 Samsung. Tesla, Sony, Sanyo, and Samsung, Samsung, I can't. Samsung, 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 Samsung. Samsung have already expressed interest in the chip, so we might end up seeing it in our phones within the next couple years. As a bonus story today, you should also check out this new video from Amazon that demonstrates the real world use of Amazon delivery drones. And I must say, using Jeremy Clarkson as the host of this demonstration definitely makes it worth watching. That's it for today. Like and subscribe below, and thanks for watching.